To me, O is feminine, K is masculine. You know, I see a couple. I'm like, okay. Okay. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mary and today I'm wrapping up the Men in Black franchise, watching Men in Black 3. This one's exciting because they travel back in time, according to the blurb, to try and save Agent K. That's about all that I know about this film. I haven't looked into it too deeply, but I know that Tommy Lee Jones is back and so is Will Smith. And that's all I need to know, quite frankly. I really, really enjoyed the first Men in Black movie. The second one fell just a little bit short for me, but that's okay. Still wanted to know about the story, still wanted to know about how they got Agent K back and his memories. All of that's very important. And now I'm ready for the third one and I've heard nothing but great things about this film. So I wanna jump into it, but before we do, I wanna remind you guys about the uncut version. That one's gonna be over on Patreon. The link for that is in the description bar and in the pinned comments down below. You just need a copy of the film so that you can watch it along with me. There will be a timer. I can be on one screen, the movie can be on another screen. It really does help support my channel out and I can continue to do what I do thanks to you guys. Down below, you can also find all my social media handles, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, Discord, TikTok, Facebook, as well as my two other channels, my gaming channel, Cherry Plays, and my vlog channel, Very Cherry. So guys, let's jump into Men in Black 3. Boris. Hey, Nicole Scherzinger, I think, from the Pussycat Dolls. Don't you wish your girlfriend was hot like me? She looks bad in a good way. Well, well, Boris the animal has a visitor. I guess one every 40 years is okay. She really is Boris's puppet. It's a cake. I decide what it is. It looks like some kind of cake. <laughs> She's clean. Well, not clean, but you know. <laughs> Rude. She's a woman on a mission to bring Boris's cake. Is it his birthday? I don't know. <laughs> Boris the animal. You've got a visitor. Boris the animal. It's just Boris. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. He looks wild as. You are much more unconventionally handsome than your photos. <laughs> Ew. Oh, that is nasty. Oh, I can see his tug. Yuck. Oh, I'm Cutting it up. <gasps> oh, oh. Oh my God, it looks like it was more than just a cake. The special effects look very cool. Far more realistic. Wow, what a handy little guy. Handy little spider. Oh God, wow, wow, wow. Wow. That's some hand see. Oh, that spider is dangerous. He's a wolf himself. I can see why he got his nickname. We had a deal. Obadiah Price. Obadiah Price. I did make your promise. Oh, great. That's just mean. There's too many of us. Rather hot in here. Mind if I open a window? Mm. Oh my God, they're out in space. Oh. Oh, at least he really cares about her. I don't know, actually. I don't know. What's happening? He's letting go. Sorry, darling. Oh. We did love the cake. How could he? That is cruel. I thought he cared about the girl. Oh, looks like he can breathe in space. Is this the moon? Looks like it's the moon. Let's rewrite history, shall we, Kane? Uh-oh. Men in Black 3. A very dramatic introduction to this movie. Keep it simple, Slick. Mm, thanks a lot. Keep Thank it you, simple, Kane. yeah. Uh, okay, you know how you're on an airplane and the flight attendant asks you to turn your cell phone off? Turn your damn cell phone off. Now you're going to drive off a cliff tonight because your GPS don't work. No, don't tell him that. Someone will if their GPS don't work. I worked with Zed for 40 years. He was a hell of an agent, and I have written a hell of a speech for him. Zed died? People will be moved. I believe it. <laughs> oh, these guys. I see. I can't believe Zed died. I worked with Zed for over 40 years, and in all that time, he never invited me to dinner. <laughs> never asked me to his house to watch a game. He never shared a single detail of his personal life. 
Wow. Any, Thank you. And whoa, is that it? <laughs> Imagine acting this. How could you not laugh? It's just so sad. Thank you. <laughs> that was so weird. How did you get to be like you? You know how I live such a happy life. How you how? live such a happy life. Him? I don't ask questions I don't want to know the answer to. I mean, he's got a point though. Ignorance is bliss in many ways. <laughs> this guy gives me Jack Black energy. Jeff Black. Oh no, it's you Boris. Your services are legendary. So says your father. Obadiah. <gasps> there is no prison that can hold me. Cool <gasps> for you. What do you need from me, man? Don't trust the him. He killed your dad. I'm going back in time to kill a man before he takes my arm. So that man's got to be Agent K. Okay, Jay. So happy to see you. Uh, Mr. Will get you your regular table. Show us the tanks in the back. Uh -huh. So sorry. No speak English. You oh, now you can't English. speak English. Ooh, man. You look like you come no. from the planet. Damn. <gasps> That's why I said it would be if you were Chinese. Oh, okay. He's not even Chinese. Who's the spiky ball before I would Nobody. <laughs> Who's it for? I keep him just in case. <laughs> <laughs> All right, slug. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> Leave him alone. Earth people get earth fish. Don't nobody want none of your nasty ass noodles, Will. You're a piece of shit. Uh, oh, I kind of feel bad for him. Ugh. That was just mean. What you did to Woo back there. It was unnecessary. I used to play a game with my dad called Catch. I would throw the ball and it would just hit the wall. It's not right. You damn right. It's not right. The little boy needs a father. Table <laughs> order today. Talking about different things. Okay, the crashed ship from this morning was stolen from Lunar Max Prison. Boris the animal. How did you know? He always had a taste for spiky bull. New straight away. I'll take the chloropod, you take the tyrannomy and the hydronian over there. Uh-oh. This, this is a very confusing time in my life. It seems like there's a lot of people or well, aliens. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god, obliterated! <laughs> oh no, the fish! Slow-mo! That's cool, that was very cool. Oh my god, stop screaming, lady. Keep your head down. Unless she's a human, she has seen something like this before. I doubt they'd hire humans. Oh my god, look at that guy's head. Is that Will? No, it's not Will. He just has the same... Oh, there's Will! Oh, rest in peace, Wooey. Oh, she was bad too. Whoa, that's a big fish. Oh! I love how he's protecting his D. Oh. Oh my god. Sneeze. He's gonna sneeze him out. Oh god. Ouch. Ew. Bro, that's nasty ass. Hello, Kay. This isn't the past. I wanted the pleasure of killing you. You're okay. Oh. <laughs> Just in time. <sighs> Your stabby boys aren't working. Oh, wow. That is such a handy door. Coming to great use. Thank you. That's hey, it. You know your kid won the goldfish in that little baggie from the school fair, and you didn't want that nasty thing in your house, so you told your kid it ran away, but what you really did was flush it down the toilet. <laughs> he just can't help himself. You will forget about Boris, or my report will reflect that your conduct has been unbecoming. Whoa. You are suspended for two weeks. What? Bullshit. Four. Weeks. Kate just doesn't want Jay to get her, and I think that's kind of sweet. So, why this sudden interest in your partner's old exploits? Hmm? Cape Canaveral. What happened? Something that changed him. Something. Very vague. A word of advice, Agent Jay. Don't ask questions you don't want to know the answer to. That's hey. funny. That is exactly what Kay said. They're very similar, too. Maybe they have some sort of romantic history going on. Ooh. What PlayStation does he have? Oh, look, the dog. I guess I owe you some answers, Hoss. I promise you the secrets of the universe, nothing more. So what, are some secrets out there that the universe don't know about? He really doesn't want to share. Must have been really traumatic for him. <gasps> this is so cool. My goodness. He's got a secret room. 
room full of guns all kinds of guns and a very cool house i might add oh my gosh already going into the past can i help you okay 5k <laughs> so he's also traveled okay get in yet Ooh. Hey, Job from Arrested Development. That Mexican throw you out? She's not that Mexican, Mom. She's my Mexican. And she's Colombian or something. But yesterday, I threw a brick right through that window, and I just want to thank you for handing me that brick, Jay. Okay, whoever you are, I need you to give me five feet, or I'm going to pluck you in your throat. Oh, damn, dude. Who was that? Double A, your partner. Double A. There's no K. This is a good one. But K, I need you to come out here now. So is this I'm just really the future without him? Oh, uh, he's the only one that remembers him. That's K. He's been dead for over 40 years. Computer agent K and Boris the animal. Oh, oh, oh shit. Agent K pronounced dead at scene and awarded posthumous he, commendation for meritorious action, which prevented greater loss of oh, human life. Oh, right. That's not what happened. It, I just looked he at changed it. And he'd say, i tell you something slick. This coffee tastes like dirt. And I was supposed to say, what do you expect? It was just, just ground, ground this morning. morning. She was involved with him. Oh, sir. Where you been, man? It was like an hour ago. <laughs> Uh, if Boris could work out how to time jump, he he could seriously change the course of history. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and he has. Okay, no defense system. You have to find Jeffrey Price. He's Obadiah's son. Why don't he just go back to 1969 in June? Going out of business. Oh. How can I help you? We're having an amazing sale on batteries. Whoa, okay, we got other stuff like headphones. <laughs> I'm gonna go back and kill the younger Boris before the older one even shows up. That way, neither of them will even exist. Uh... You wanna save your partner? Word of advice stay away from him. Stay away from K, just kill Boris. Now, take these, because it gets pretty windy on the way down. The way windy. down? Oh! <laughs> I'm not jumping off of this building. Time jump. Oh, God. That is terrifying, but hey, the scenery, it looks beautiful. Do not lose that time device or you will be stuck in 1969. It wasn't the best time for your people. Oh, <laughs> how will I know if it works? You'll either know. <laughs> it's true. It's right. Or you won't. That's so fake still. How come I remember Kate, but nobody else does? That means you were there. I was well. there. If you survive, you gotta come back and tell me everything, okay? If you survive. Go, go, go. Oh my god, this is so scary. Oh lord. <gasps> Holy crap. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Oh my god, I would be so afraid of messing it up. Oh, freaking hell. No. Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. I'm so frustrated. Oh wow. Hold tightly onto it. Nice. Nice. <gasps> the hell was that a dinosaur wall street crash billions lost war is over oh my gosh so much going on <gasps> whoa why is time travel so traumatic in men in black <laughs> he's so traumatized Look at it, poor guy. Oh man, what's the day? Tuesday. The date? The 15th of July. The year? 1969. <laughs> Thank you. Look at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> Most people don't say the year when they're asked what day it is, to be fair. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me, who is that? Who are you? <laughs> at least he's driving a nice whip. That's so colorful. There he is. If you want to keep that, I wouldn't. Make love, not war. Oh my god. I prefer to do both. <laughs> god. Oh. Oh. Don't ever laugh again. Please. Oh, he's probably getting stopped because of his skin color. Hey, what kind of work do you do? An individual of your particular ethnic wow. persuasion. I knew it. I stole them both. Car from your wife, suit from your grandmother. <laughs> I don't blame him. And I demand to see my lawyer before you press that small button on the side firmly. Press it. Uh. <laughs> Thank God and for the new realizer. just a black man driving in a nice car does not mean it's stolen. I stole that one, but not because I'm black. <laughs> <laughs> Neuralize everyone in 1969 and make them not racist. It's how you cure racism. <laughs> 
Oh my god. At least he has his location. Are you a good enough shot? <gasps> oh no. We'll take it from here. Kay? Hey, it's a young K? K! K! Oh! <gasps> Whoa, you were told not to talk to Kay. <laughs> I know he found you, but you acted like you knew him. How do you know my name? Because I called you Kay? No, I call uh, everybody Kay. What up, Kay? Kay. Bye, <laughs> Lying son of a bee. I was out there waiting for my girl, who, by the way, is probably worried sick. What's your gal's name? Huh? <laughs> Sharon? Sharon. Sharon. The most creative name you could come up with. Think of an ex's name. Terribly sorry. Ex is frightfully upset about the Hey. Is that O? Oh, man. This coffee tastes like dirt. What do you expect? It was a this morning. O? And he knows O no, as well. Me. To me, O is feminine. K is masculine. You know, I see a couple. I'm like, okay. <laughs> what a mess. <laughs> oh. Yes, okay. Just one last thing. An eye exam. It's not an eye exam, K. That's a big ass neuralizer. Uh. You sure have a lot of information for a fellow who doesn't know anything. Hey, you know what, K? We need to hold up a second. K. Oh, don't neuralize him. He can't help oh you. Don't put me in here, K. Too late, Austin. Oh, no. K, no. Listen to me. Stop. I can help you with this case. No, don't neuralize him, please. God damn it. K, listen to me. Listen, you please. The whole world. Stop the thing. Oh, my God. When you see bars tomorrow, okay, kill him. Do not arrest him. Kill him. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, thank God. I was so stressed. I knew Roman. His wife cooked me dinner once, and while it was not pleasant, he was my friend. While it was not pleasant. Last chance. Who are you, and what do you know? Agent K, what's he still doing here? I might have cooked him for too long. Thought I'd better walk him out. I put my pants on. Uh, he's pretending to be neuralized. Okay, future man, where to? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Go wherever you went last time. I haven't been here last time. I didn't tell you where I went. No, I mean, uh, we don't really talk. What kind of partner sit in the car all day, every day, 14 years and don't talk? Uh, exactly. <laughs> these two. There was something in a file about a factory. Something happened at, at a factory. Okay. Look at his face. It's exactly the same as Tommy Lee Jones. Uh, He's looking at him so intensely. Hey, man, hey, how old are you? 29. 29? Wow. You have some city miles on you. I'm Looks to older. We don't talk. Looks way older. I don't like it. I hate going in blind. I'm going to need my gun. Sure thing, Slick. Sure it's thing, okay. Slick. <gasps> no, I got go with you. you. just sit tight. I'll be fine. Oh, no. You idiot. Hey. You need help. No. Damn. Exactly, have ourselves a standoff. Looks that way. Except he has more guns on you. Hey, he got away. Hey, Slick, you bold in the future? Oh, you did not just walk into <gasps> the establishment. All right, you're here. Oh, dude. If Come on, this, spill the beans. God damn, dude. All right, he's in the back. Well, we're on the right track. The wrong train. If he had any secrets, I'm guessing he spilled them. Dead. And that third planet, wasn't it? Glamoria? Glamoria? Very nice. Blink. Oh wow, they look so cool. Mr. Warhol, can we have a minute? Just a few questions. No questions, no answers, just be. Wow, he looks so interesting. Is Andy Warhol an alien too? Are you okay? Are you trying to blow my cover? Agent W, your cover is safe. Last of its species. His name's Griffin. Griffin the Arcanan. Griffin the Arcanan. That's him. How's it going? For me personally, it's good. Things are good. So unless, of course, we're in the possible future where the muscle boy near the door gets into an argument with his girlfriend. It causes her to throw away and bump into the guy carrying stuff mushrooms and then stand with a cigarette leaving. And shoving that guy's having a crush into the coffee table In which case, I got to move my plate, like, right now. Predicted everything. Could use this guy. Oh, my God. Okay. He's so well, we weird. Find this guy. What am I <laughs> that you can live in and visualize an infinite set of time-space probabilities simultaneously. That's really good. May I see your watch? Oh, it is 718. No, 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 your other watch, the one your father gave you. Oh, wow. You no, know so much. You know hey, we're here because of Boris the animal. Correct. We believe he may be coming. coming to kill me. Yes, he'll be here in two minutes, unless, of course, we're in the possible future where he made all the lights on Bowery and got here early and is just about to discharge a weapon from the doorway, in which case we're all dead in two seconds. Ah, good. That was a close one. Oh! Okay, sorry. I have something for you. I had to hide it from Boris, but if you find me again, I'll give it to you. He's such Thank a you. happy what guy, though. Oh, dear. 
Oh no, what's up? This is the one where Boris is coming through that door in 12, 11, 10. Oh no. That guy is very handy to have around. Damn. They missed him again though. When you say we don't talk, right? You go ahead. Ask me any question. Anything you want. He's way more open. What's up with you and Al? All right, this is it. A while back, I was assigned to keep tabs on a musician, Mick Jagger. Mick Jagger? And so I was in London, and that's when I met Al. Just smart, funny. That's Great sweet. Smile. We just played darts until the sun came up. What the hell happened to you, man? I don't know. It hasn't happened yet. Aww. Total loses. It's a rough time to be a Mets fan. Tell me about it. Three months from now, your buddies down there are going to be calling them the amazing Mets. And the he knows his sports Mets. history. We got there, Hoss. Hoss. Yeah, Cannon said it's amazing. It's a miracle. I'll see you at the game. I know where he is. Told you to trust the pie. Just a coincidence. I think it's time to give you your things back, partner. Finally. You get some pie in you, get all mushy. I'm just tired of carrying your stuff. <laughs> Let's Griffin. go, Matt. Oh, you're just in time. The game. The game? Nothing's happening. Oh. That's pretty cool. So this is how you see things. This is amazing. It's a gigantic pain in the ass, but it has its moments. I can imagine. Um, the gift? See, yeah. Oh, 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 yes, of course. Yeah, the box. he tends to go on, eh? It's the surprise. To protect the earth, it's the shield. The shield. Shield. Arcane and Arknet. That's what you uh, did. Uh, I lost my planet. Mm -hmm. I don't want you to lose yours. It'll take a miracle, but if you pull this off, you'll be my new favorite moment in human history. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. I forgot to see this one coming. <gasps> oh, no! They took him! So quick! What happens if Boris gets the Arknet? Bogla died invasion, total destruction to burn! We don't want that to happen. Ah, uh, sideways. Hey, Slick. In the future, we ever do the Texas two-step? Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, hell yeah. Making him angry. <gasps> Did he die? Did he die? Did you get him? Give me a sec. I don't think that's it. <gasps> Two. Pathetic waste of boglodyte flesh. Who are you? Look at you. Every mistake I've ever made just <gasps> waiting to happen. He's even mean to his past self. No human can defeat me. No person can hold me. Oh my god. Stop arguing. You can avoid all of that if you just listen to me. Yeah. It. You let it get shut off. That was you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get the Arknet. Kill Agent K. And we'll get to keep both of our... Stop! Stay <laughs> at it! Sensitive. Thank you for saving my life. You still have the arc net? He is the protection? He needs to be protected. At all costs. No wonder his eyes are so blue. Once it's outside wondering. the atmosphere, it gets a whole lot bigger. All you have to do is deploy it. It's just one small step. One giant leap for mankind. Moon launch today. Better get a move on, Slick. Uh, uh, wait, uh, hold, hold up. Not, not us. Uh, I'm going to do this one alone. Why no, the... he has to be the one. Shh, shh, shh. What do you mean alone? Oh, he can't know about his death. I don't think so. Something you're not telling me, Slick. Yep. Okay, please. I will not allow you to go to Florida. Stop me. I hate it when you're in the past and you're trying to explain you something to there. somebody. And yeah, it's it just goes like this. Cape Canaveral, <laughs> Apollo launch. Boris kills you there. That's what I'm here for. That's what I came back to stop. Mm. I saw the file. I looked at the report. Now, I, now I know I said I told you everything, but you got. Oh, that's for lying to me. Look, I'm sorry, man. What's that for? That's for telling me the truth. <laughs> Other guys the just like. Truth is better than the sweetest lies. <laughs> it's a bit much sometimes. Is there any future where I save his life? Of course, there has to be. Yes, but where there is death. There will always be death. As in a life for a life? Is that what he's implying? According to you, I've done this before, so we know it's possible. The partners, you tell me. Let's go. Yeah. Agent K, how are you? I'm good. Okay, group hug on the way to doing what we're doing. Agent K. Hi. She really likes him. Look, I gotta ask you. If we pull this off, fix things the way they were. O and I are we wise man mm. once told me don't ask questions you don't want to know the answer to. Maybe this is like the I said that, didn't I? Yes, sir. Bootstrap paradox. The future impacts the past, past impacts the future. Do you even know how to work this stupid thing? Like with anything. Just have to strap yourself in. Hope for the best. Huh. <laughs> 
Isn't that right, Miss O? Unfortunately, it is. She loves him. Sad? You ready, Slick? Let's get it. Let's get it. So glad this isn't one of the times we explode. <laughs> One at a time. He has to say things like that. If you pose a threat to that rocket, you tell me now and do not lie to me. Sir, if I may. Show him the way. Griff should have just done that at the beginning. I don't know why he didn't. Cheers, Griff. Cheers for waiting this long to do that. Uh, I, I have to go now. Where? Thanks, man. Hey, will I ever see you again? Anything's possible. All right, then keep your secrets. I can never bear to watch this part. Oh, why? What the heck? What did Griff show you back there? He showed me how important you are. Oh. You and your partner. Oh, that's nice. If he does, I'm gonna probably end up having to get out of here pretty quick. Scoot. So, I'm not gonna have a chance to say a proper goodbye. If things go wrong, I'm not gonna have a chance to either. True. But I hope they win. See why I recruited you. You good man. <laughs> what the hell happened to you? I told you it still hasn't happened yet. I do wonder what it was. Naughty. Oh yeah. no, it's happened. You might want to get a pedicure if you get a second. <laughs> he has to be a smart ass. He can't help it. Oh! Oh, thank God he had something to grab onto. <gasps> Don't lose it, dude. Force the animal! He hates that. He hates that. It's just force. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna lose. Let's agree to disagree. <laughs> oh my god, ouch. That sounded painful. One on one? Dude, I would not. Ooh. Ooh. <gasps> oh. I'm gonna travel in time with him? You're gonna lose. Let's hey, back to this moment. Hey, oh, so he knows how to defeat him. One, two, three, right? right. Oh, wow. That's not possible. Let's agree to disagree. <gasps> wow. Wow. So this one died, but he's the future one. He needs the other one to die. That is the most important thing. Mm. Oh, wow. Get the device. Wow, what a jump. Mission successful. Good job. Ow. You did it. I know a top secret organization that can use a man like you. I wish I could. Gonna recruit the other guy as well. Look out! <gasps> oh no! What? Go ahead, arrest me. Whoa, he's still here. Oh, thank God! Finally. Where there's death, there will always be death. Oh, so the mm, this guy died. He sacrificed himself. I mean, without knowing. Oh, no. No, no, no. Hey, my name's Kay. What's your name? James. 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 Where's my dad? Oh, your dad died. Oh, that's so dad? tragic. My dad gave it to me. We talked a lot. Holy crap. No. Where's my dad? That's him as a kid? Oh, this poor kid. Jesus. James, if you look right here, I will tell you the only thing you ever need to know. What does he tell him? Your daddy is a hero. That's all he knew about his dad. You want to take a walk with me? Oh my gosh. He always knew Kay. This is so cute. Holy crap. Big lights will inspire you. See if from New York. If Kay had died, he'd have his dad. Did we go to Woo's last night? Yeah. Did we talk right. on the phone last night? You hung up on me. But that was because of all of those secrets oh. the universe doesn't know about. Oh, that's why he kept it a secret from him. Because of his dad, of course. And really, I just want to say thank you. It's been my privilege. It's like he got a different dad. 
You know, there's a really high possibility now that I might know some things you don't know. I doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This is my new favorite moment in human history. Oh, I love this guy. This is the one where Kay forgot to leave a tip. Did he? Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, oh. Saved. Oh, good. That was a close one. This poor guy, burdened with all the possibilities. Normally when they take the main actor out of a franchise and they replace him with a younger actor, I'm a little bit hesitant, but I think Josh Brolin was the perfect choice for Agent K. He really captured what Tommy Lee Jones put into the Agent K character in the past two films and in this film as well. They had the same expressions and even though the younger Agent K was a little bit more full of hope and life, he still had the same expressions that Tommy Lee Jones would have. So really, really good choice there. I'm super happy with it because I do imagine Tommy Lee Jones was probably not keen for something that involved a massive adventure being his age. I'm guessing he's 76 now, which means he would have been 65-ish around the time when this movie was released. This movie was released in 2012. Men in Black 1 was released in 97 and Men in Black 2 was released in 2002. So they had a pretty long gap, a 10-year gap. Will Smith looks pretty much the same. Tommy Lee Jones looks like he definitely aged quite a bit in the third movie. I was actually sad that we didn't get to see Tony Shalhoub in this film, but I do like some of the new characters that they introduced to us. Boris the Animal, I think, was the best villain out of the entire franchise. He was just such a beast. And he was portrayed by Jermaine Clement, a New Zealand actor. I thought he was a great choice as the villain. He portrayed it really well, and he was just very crazy and very indestructible. So he was definitely my favorite villain out of the entire franchise. They also went back in time in this film and I love time travel films in general. Griffin introduced us to all of the different possibilities which reminded me of the multiverse really because there are so many different outcomes and each time we do one simple thing it leads to another act and if we are to do something slightly different it creates another possibility in the space-time continuum so I'm very happy that they introduced us to the Griffin character he was very interesting although he gave me a little bit of secondhand anxiety because even though he seems like a really happy and bubbly guy and he's always smiling, all of his scenarios that sort of go through in his brain and he sort of vocalizes, he definitely spreads that sort of anxious, nervous energy out there. He puts it out there, but he's a really interesting character and a really sweet guy. I finally understood why Agent J doesn't have a relationship with his father. And I understand now Agent K's reservations about letting J know because essentially, Jay lived and that is why his dad didn't live that day. A life for a life. It's quite sad, but in some ways, Agent K becomes his father. And I didn't really understand at the time what the time traveling bloke in the store meant when he said, oh, you're the only person that remembers him. That's weird. You must have been there at the event. At the time, I didn't think about it too much, but it makes sense that he was the son of the officer. We actually had quite an amazing cast for this film. Emma Thompson as Agent O and the younger Agent O is played by Alice Eve, who we know from Star Trek. And then we had Bill Hader as Andy Warhol. Nicole Scherzinger actually was Boris's girlfriend, so I got that one right. I think Josh Brolin's performance was amazing in this film. He really, really got Agent K down perfectly. And even though we didn't get to see too much of Tommy Lee Jones, he captured the essence of Agent K so perfectly that it didn't even matter at all to me. The pacing in this film was really well done. The jokes were fresher as well. He got to go back in time, so it was a different sort of formula as well. This film isn't like the first two films because of the time traveling aspect and because of the fact that Agent K dies and the entire mission is about saving Agent K. I do wish that I got to learn a little bit more about Agent O and Agent K's past history, but romances and their personal lives don't seem to be a very massive plot in this franchise, which is also fine. I think we just like to think that 
they have their little flings here and there and their loves from time to time but nothing can ever really unfurl because of their line of work which definitely does make sense it's just a little bit sad but it is what it is they are all a part of something that has a much greater cause and they're doing really well the way i'd rank these films is probably number one has got to be my favorite number three and then number two number two is definitely the weakest for me i'm even tempted to put number three and one on par with each other just because number three was so unique and it didn't follow the classic formula and it even made me cry and I never really thought that I would cry in a men in black movie it's just so upbeat it's so fun and funny and it has so much adventure and it barely gets too emotional but the whole thing about his dad just really tore me up inside and it's all quite unfortunate and I also now understand why Griffin didn't want to join them at, at the last part of the mission it's just all very sad there is a men in black international that i haven't really heard great things about so i probably won't check that out but do let me know what you thought of this entire franchise including the men in black international film without any spoilers please in the comment section below i'd love to know your ranking as well and i want to know if it's the same as my ranking so let me know your thoughts in the comment section below do give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it really does help my channel out and if you want to support me you can by watching the uncut version of this video it's over on patreon the link is in the description bar and in the pinned comments down below really appreciate your support over there down below you can also find all of my social media hands Handles, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, Discord, TikTok, Facebook, as well as my two other channels, my gaming channel, Cherry Plays, and my vlog channel, Very Cherry. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you in the next one. Bye everyone.